Hey, what's up, everybody? This is your boy. This is Matt, and you're watching This is Matt TV. I'm a little under the weather right now. If you can't hear it, my nose and all that shit, all congested and all that shit. But um, this is a very important day for my twin brothers, Jay Z, Kanye West. Um, as you know, it's the first week of the album sales, and Watch Your Throne has sold. 400 and let me see 436 units in the first week and they're number one in 23 countries that's great news that is perfect um, I know I kind of went overboard in the first video and I was like saying it was going to sell between 700 and a million but hey we was all amped up right but they did very good and congratulations to my big brothers Kanye and Jay because they also broke a record for um, selling 260 something thousand units digitally no 290 thousand units sold on iTunes so they broke a record which was held by Coldplay so they broke that record another milestone for the two fellas and another big shout out to my biggest brother Jay-Z because he also got his 12th consecutive number one album. This man, he already pushed Elvis out the box. This man is looking to knock out the Beatles, which has 18 consecutive. Uh, so, I don't know. Jay-Z wouldn't last that long. You know, he's still got best of albums to come out with and he probably come up with remix albums and you know things like that so I don't know he could actually beat out the Beatles and become number one of all time of number one albums that is crazy that is, that's past Madonna that's past Michael Jackson that's past Beyonce that's past Whitney Houston's and that's past you know all, all your Elvis's and you know all your great times all your great time favorites Jay has passed him and he's just got one target in front of him which is the Beatles which was what four guys so yeah that's a big milestone um but they've sold nearly 500,000 copies in the first week which is good which is great loving it Congratulations, Jay Z and Kanye West. And all, I feel like shit right now. Like, seriously, my throat hurts. My nose and shit all congested up. I don't know how the fuck I caught this cold. Like, seriously, I really don't know how I caught I don't. I try not to stay around people. You know, because people got germs and shit. So I, I don't know how the fuck I caught it. It's summertime. That's like the worst time to catch a cold. When it's hot and humid and you just. <laughs> You know, doing all that shit. It's just, it's horrible. But how the fuck did I catch this shit? I really don't know. I, it probably, most likely, it has something to do with taking a shower and probably sitting underneath the fan or some shit afterwards. That's, that's the only thing I can come up with. You know. It's the only thing I can come up with. I mean, I passed my HIV test, got a 67. <laughs> but no, that's nothing to joke about. Please know your status and everything. But you know, saying like I just don't understand how the fuck I quit this cold. Anyway, back to Jay Z and Kanye West. This is also Kanye West's fifth consecutive number one album. So guess who's right behind you, Jigger? Guess who's right behind you? That that's a good good accomplishment by both guys. Love it. Um. I also want to come back and give you my second review on this Watch the Throne thing. Um, no doubt about it, I do think it could have been better. It does sound more like Kanye West CD than it does a Jay-Z CD. You know, um, I guess because Kanye is more, has more productions, you know, made the beats and all that shit and majority of the hooks. Um, I don't know. I mean, it's a good album. Don't get me wrong. It's a good album, especially if you just listen to the lyrics. But, you know, sometimes you just think it could be better. But, you know, who doesn't think that with every album it could be better? You know, so 
I wouldn't clarify it as classic, but what makes up for it not being a classic? Being number one in 23 countries in the first week, breaking records for iTunes, uh, breaking your own record with number ones as a solo artist, Jay-Z, 12th album, um, Kanye West, 5th album, consecutive number one. That's a consecutive, consecutive, sorry. It's the nose, it makes the Z's and the S's and shit and it swaps them, you know? See, I was about to say zops them, but I said swaps them. Never mind. But if you haven't bought, um, Watch the Throne, make sure you get it, whether it's on iTunes, whether you go to your local Walmart, Targets, whatever store that sells them, you know, get it, get it, get it, get it. It's still a good album to have. I love you all. Make sure y'all press that subscribe button. Make sure you uh, rate the video. And make sure you leave a comment. And also make sure you follow me on Twitter at ThisIsMac. That's T-H-I-S-I-S-M-A-C-K. Some people don't know how to spell, so I have to promote that. I'll put the link in the bottom if you didn't really get it. Got it? Good. But anyway, I'm going to finish drinking my um, orange juice and eating Pop-Tarts and stuff like that. So I can get better, so I can get my singing voice back. Ooh, I don't know, I don't know. See, it, it's way better. I don't, <clears throat> I don't want to fuck my voice up and stuff. But, but it's better than that. That's just a little taste, huh? I don't want to give y'all too much and stuff. But anyway, I love y'all. If today's your birthday, happy freaking birthday. And leave me your comments. Let me know what you think about, you know, the first week album sales. I would love to know. Did you think it could have done better? Was you not expecting that much? Was that was around that much you was expecting? I don't know. And please give me a, you know, get well soon card. Because <laughs> my nose is stopped up. My throat is dry and sore. <sighs> I'm not even going to work today. And I got off work early yesterday. I might not even go in tomorrow. Because burn notice comes on tomorrow too. <sighs> and um, the oldest video, loved it. Like, I didn't really like it like it, but just to see Jay-Z having so much fun, it's so addictive. Like, you barely see Jay-Z, you know. <laughs> You know, he's smiling, he's cheesing his ass off, so, you know, I still like that part. And there's a part, I think it's at 3.01 to, like, 3.03, and Kanye West driving the car, and the car kind of turns to the side, and it slides toward the cam, and you see Jay-Z face just, like, looking at the cam, coming closer. I don't know, something about that part is just, I fucking love that part. For some reason, it looked like a good screenshot that I fucking love, and am I losing weight? I don't know, but it's just great, so you make sure you look at the video, fade the video, make sure you love this video too that I'm making, because I'm doing this for y'all and I'm sick, literally sick, so you're supposed to love this video, and that I really love y'all so much that I came back to do this video for you all. <sighs> the things I do for YouTube and my family and friends and fans that's the three F's family, friends and fans anything else that I would F that I could use positively no negative shit not fags or phonies or femmes or fruitcakes or flubblomian ok I just made that word out but still Alright, y'all. Um, this is like my fourth time saying bye. So, bye. Peace out. Love you all.